My um, favourite records at uh, Queensland State Archives are the um, cabinet minutes and associated records with the establishment of the Mon Repo uh, Turtle Rookery, which is up near Bundaberg. Even though cabinet records may not be very exciting, ever since I was a kid, I've been interested in turtles and tortoises. I've collected them, you know, pottery ones and small, you know, ornamental ones. And I even own my own uh, turtle um, at home. First cabinet records start to mention the rookery in around 1973, when uh, applications were being made to the state government to either turn the area into a national park so that the turtle rookery could be preserved, um, or to acquire land in that area so that the, uh, the rookery could um, uh, be used for uh, preservation and environmental purposes. At the time, the proposal to uh, acquire the land was strongly opposed by the Wangara Shire Council. But the state government had stepped in to try and preserve the land as national park to protect this uh, world heritage almost environmental area for the preservation of turtles. And the next significant instance is about 1982, where there was a, uh, a council application from Wangara Shire Council asking to allow the development on land that would impact on the turtle rookery at Mon Repo. There were a huge amount of objections to uh, this uh, uh, development application at the time. Even people like Prince Philip uh, uh, lodged an objection to say that it shouldn't go ahead. The government did step in to uh, compulsorily acquire land and this even went on to the Land Appeal Court at a later, uh, a later stage and the figure was eventually brought down in about 1986 to $170,000. It's been on my bucket list since coming, to, coming and living in Australia to go and visit Mon Repo and I eventually managed to uh, cross this off my uh, bucket list in 2011 and it was one of the most wonderful, amazing nights of my life seeing these wonderful, huge, majestic creatures coming in at the beach and laying their eggs, surrounded by hundreds of people and not caring that, you know, the, these people are watching them probably in one of their, mo their, their most private moments. And just the, uh, the awesomeness of the whole experience and seeing these great, wonderful creatures coming up and laying their eggs um, and being privileged enough to be able to see it. That's why these uh, particular records, even though you might say, yes, they're dry, boring, old cabinet minutes, um, that's why these records have particular importance to me and particular relevance.